Hello vlog, how are you all doing? Welcome back to the vlogs. We haven't been active for a while for baby stuff, but today we are at the hospital. You can't even see my bum, no. I look pregnant. We're at the hospital today for our baby because we're getting induced today. Are, hang on, we are getting induced? Well, Lizzie's getting induced today. Uh, so it's gonna be the start of our next life with our little Parker baby, so we're just gonna get the stuff ready and all that. I'll put it in now? that one there, just so that I can get it run. So we've got the car all packed, ready. This is the bump. There's Lizzie with bump update. <laughs> and uh, we're just gonna head off in, and then the next time, well, you'll see throughout the labor process, obviously not the guru, gooey bits. The gooey bits. The gooey bits, they'll be edited out. Uh, but you'll see the labor, you'll see the baby, and uh, yeah, so, this Exciting. is the start of the <laughs> family vlogs and our next chapter in our life. We are now in the waiting room, ready, uh, just waiting oh. here for um, yeah. someone to come and pick us up, the midwife. So there's Lizzie. We're getting a little bit nervous now. Uh, but yeah, we will hopefully be in our room soon and then be able to calm down, get a drink or something, and then relax until the main event happens when this one's trying to push that thing out of a... <laughs> you know what? I have been into our delivery room. This is our room where we are going to spend the next... However long it takes. So we're going to get comfortable and This everything. is where we would take him when we're We've been in this room before, actually. Uh, we've been a couple of times because we've had some complications. That's why we've been Since um, we had the early labour problems away. at 25 weeks. So she's getting induced at 34 weeks. 34, 35, it's a bit... Who uh, measures 35 weeks? It's a bit up and down because the scans are saying 35, five but they're saying 34. So it's a bit up From and down. But um, yeah, since um, early labour on the 25 weeks, we've been having not problems, but just up and down, bits. Up and down bits coming. That's why we haven't Back really been vlogging that much and all that. And uh, other stuff has happened. Water yeah, waters are broken. December. 27th, so Liz was in after Christmas as well. I've been over Christmas so as well. we've been doing a lot of that. So we have been really busy, everything like that. Nala is at mum and dad's, so she's not on she's her own. There. She really enjoys it there. Um, so, yeah, we've got a lot of things to do here. We've got baby stuff and all that. We've got the bag. This bag here was £20, which ain't too bad for millets. Uh, so that's our baby proof bag. We've got another bag in the car which has got all the clothes in it and all that. That's got the essentials like the chargers and all that for phones. So yeah, this is going to be the room where okay. hopefully we have Parker here and all that. So he's going to have to stay in for three days, which we've already been told about. So that's fine uh, just for monitoring everything like that because he's 34 weeks and not being full term. So yeah, we're just going to sit here relax and see how we can get on with stuff so hope you enjoy this vlog of many with our new son so next time hopefully you'll see us a little bit later on in the process right we are in stage one of labor or i would say labor we're not even there yet we're hooked up to the monitor which is over here ow there's a light up there as well so you'll be able to hear his heartbeat, hopefully. So that's Parker's heartbeat there. That's Lizzie's contraction and she's on one. one at the moment. She's not screaming the place down yet. So we are slowly working our way up. Next update on the baby situation. We have started the inducing process. Liz is there relaxing, she just had the gel put in and uh, yeah, she's got to stay there for an hour and then they'll come back and monitor her and see if uh, stuff is progressing and then she'll be allowed to walk about for a bit so we'll go for a little walk around the hospital and see what we can do and then come back here and then hopefully some progress has been done. Little update on Baby Parker at the moment. Uh, so we have just nearly done an hour now since the gel has gone in on the monitor. Uh, so we're just waiting for that to finish. Uh, it seems to be started because Lizzie is starting to feel some 
tightened down there so we are hopefully going the right direction uh, and everything like that so hopefully um, to come off in a little bit we will be able to go for a little walk around the hospital we might go to the canteen before it closes and grab some hot food and then come back up here and see how we feel uh, but yeah this is doing amazing there you go yeah, we've just got some drinks here, and uh, you can probably hear Parker in the background with his heartbeat. He's doing really well and everything like that. So yeah, we're just sat here waiting. Hello everyone, how are you all doing? It is two in the morning, quarter past two in the morning, and we have reached one centimetre dilated. About one o'clock though. About one o'clock, yeah. Um, I've had a little sleep on... I will put the worst chair there is, I will show you. I'll get Liz to hold the camera for you so you can see what's happening. Imagine trying to sleep oh, hang on. on something Ooh. like this. Why isn't it, hang on, it's not focusing properly and I've not got a free hand. Oh. Okay. Go on, push it all the way, push it all the way back and show, I'll show them what it does. When you imagine push. trying to get comfortable on a chair that does this. <laughs> I don't know if it showed it, but it lifts up at the bottom. These two legs, I don't even know if Jack knows. No. But it lifts up at the bottom. Like that. It is so uncomfortable. <laughs> but, yeah, no, we have got some drips going in. We're sorting out, a little, sorting out a little plan at the moment as well, what we can do next. Liz is on the monitor again. Once again, we know this monitor quite well. Uh, we've got the drip, it's just, what is that? Like, 10 Basically antibiotics, basically. A liquid form of antibiotics. Uh, but yeah, we've just got a plan. We're gonna see one of the doctors soon and see what we can do. Uh, but yeah, that's the update at the moment. Um, and yeah, we're just sat here. There's not much out of the window this time. The other rooms have been good, but. Oh. Well, this one does have your favorite part in. Well. If you look down the down there, but... Not yeah, not that well. But, um, yeah, no, we're just relaxing and waiting for this baby to come. Hello, everyone. As you can see, it's daylight outside. Um, so, um, we've changed our plan a little bit um, with stuff going on last night. Um, had some complications, so uh, they've put Lizzie on the cesarean list uh, for today because uh, they let her do the natural birth, trying to do it naturally, but it just didn't work. The machine was going a bit skew whiff and all that, and Parker wasn't enjoying it and all that. So um, they have put her on the cesarean list for today. So Parker should be born today, just getting everything sorted, everything ready for when the doctors take us down to the theatre. It's not like a theatre where you watch movies, which is different. Um, so yeah, we're just getting ready to prepare for the cesarean side of stuff. Uh, that was on the that was on our birthing plan as well. If stuff didn't go right on the way, doing naturally, because he's only 34 weeks, they were like, we'll try it naturally first. If it goes right, then carry on but throughout the night it just didn't work and all that. So they've decided cesarean's gonna be the best thing. Less stress on Parker, less stress on Lizzie and all that. We were happy with that because we've spoken about that already. So yeah, that is the update. You keep dropping that, don't you? So that's the latest update at the moment. Hopefully they might let me bring you into theatre. They might not. They might do pictures. Hopefully, if they do, I can. Um, might swap over to the iPhone um, just in case um, but if not we will film after when baby is out um, because it is a stellar environment and I don't really want to bring a camera in that isn't sterile to a theatre um, but other than that yeah we're doing good um, sleep wise on this chair not good um, got a little bit of sleep not proper deep sleep as you can see these things called bags under my eyes i'm tired but i'd rather be here than at home waiting nala's at mum and dad so she's fine 
um, and all that. So yeah, we're just gonna prepare for the C-section. Liz can't have any food, but that's fine. She didn't have anything until like late last night and then stopped it all. Um, other than that, yeah, hope you're enjoying it. It's happening, we're going. It's the last ever bump that you're gonna see. There's a little cutie in this scrubs. And um, hashtag easy trainers. <laughs> yeah. So we are ready to go. Um, I can't take the camera in, but I've got my phone, so I'll add some photos towards this as well. Um, so yeah, so we need to go to special care, like we said. Just so um, yeah, so I'm gonna pop over there with him, and Liz will come back here to recover it, and then be over there as well. So uh, yeah, we're going to have our baby now. Hello vlog. So me and Lizzie are parents now. Uh, Parker was born around about 11.28 this morning, um, so he is doing fine. Got a little chest infection, which was expected because he's 34 weeks. Um, so yeah, just had some lunch and all that, come back to look after Lizzie for a bit and then I'll probably go back over and see my son. So yeah, we're just so everyone, meet baby Parker. We are back from visiting Baby Parker now. Um, I've had some pain relief. I've expressed a bit more colostrum for him because that's come in at a good break, would you say? Yeah. Yeah, I'm getting good help from my uh, husband over there. Hello, everyone. <laughs> He's being really, really good. I couldn't ask for a better husband. Um, I think we're going to kind of call it time for the vlog today. We're just about to be moved rooms. Um, onto the normal postnatal and antenatal ward um, and then we can we can kind of go and see him as we want um, so like if in the middle of the night I wake up and I want to go and see him I can I've just obviously after having a c-section what oh almost 12 hours ago now um, I've just got to take it careful make sure I take, stay on top of my pain relief and yeah and if I need help just ask for it because it's always there Hello everyone, so it is about two weeks after since the start of the birthing vlog which is carrying on from today. Um, we are still in the hospital, um, Parker is still in the hospital, Lizzie has been discharged from the hospital three days after giving birth. Now you haven't seen him on the vlog because he was wished the way into special care um, so I couldn't really film in there. There was other babies in there. He's been on special care for two weeks as he had a breathing problem when he first born um, and they had to put some surfactica? Surfactin. which is basically like um, washing up liquid fluid, but it's not. It's um, the stuff what your lungs yeah. make. It's like £2,000 per, yeah. per shot. £2,000 for this medication and it has made him better. It's life-saving basically. Uh, so here is our little man, Parker Jack Willis. Here he is. <laughs> the first of many things he's gonna be on the vlog. He this is his feeding tube. This is Peter Rabbit from his nanny. That's his little card thing and all there. So that's our little baby. There he is. First one on the vlog, and he's going to be on there for a long time after. He's doing really well. Lizzie is in the room, but I'm not going to show you because she is milking her boobs at the moment. But yeah, no, um, I'll have a look if it is. No, I have to blur that bit out because you're not allowed nudity on YouTube. But there's our little son, he's doing really well. So, this is why there hasn't been much footage of him. You might have seen a couple of short videos. Uh, on the channel um, but yeah other than that I can't really work out a camera in the middle of a special care unit uh, but yeah we're in one of their special rooms tonight I don't know if you can see like hospital rooms first night we're actually gonna spend because we've been going back and forth from home to um, thingy give you a little update on that later on when we're actually at home um, but other than that no they don't know about this one there's a lot of, well, I will tell you, but we've been focused on Parker at the yeah. moment. But uh, yeah, he's doing really well. So hopefully 
he hopefully he'll come home soon uh, but yeah he's just there relaxing so that's what we've been up to recently so there has been no vlog or anything like that no gaming at the moment so that'll get sorted whenever but um yeah i'll get back to gaming and all that hopefully when we get home and get sorted nala is all fine she's been looked after by my mum and dad which is really nice of them so that's really good if we didn't have them we wouldn't have nala would be on her own all the time and it would mean traveling an hour to go and see her in the morning an hour in the evening to go see her to come back here to see parker so they've looked after her which is really good um so we will get something for them when we can uh but yeah we're just gonna sit and relax for the evening and hopefully get him home soon so um i've just got a shower which means that i've had some time to actually have a shower um we are back in the room tonight um, which is really lucky. Parker has been doing so well that they're kind of hoping that he comes home soon. Um, so yeah, back in the room, Parker's all tucked up, ready to, well, is in bed. Um, he's due to feed again at around 10 to 10. Time is just about 8 o'clock, so we might be able to get a little bit of a nap in before then, but we might not. That's parenthood. <laughs> Um, we snuggled up with this little Peter Rabbit from his nanny. Nala is again of what we're at what we're calling nanny daycare um, with Dawn, and she absolutely loves it there. Hello, everyone. A couple of days after the last bit of the vlog, uh, where we were staying in at the hospital, um, we have finally left the hospital now. Parker has been discharged and everything like that he is safe and well doing brilliantly he is right there in his little bed uh which is downstairs which is the buggy part um and all that safe bringing down his bed from upstairs so gonna end the little baby vlog here so from now on the vlogs are gonna be a lot different because we've got an extra person with us um we've got parker with us so he's doing all right uh nala's really well with him she's brilliant with him so uh yeah i'm gonna end the vlog here i hope you enjoyed it if you have make sure you subscribe and don't forget to ring the bell don't forget to ring the bell and we will see you again soon for some more family vlogs now Goodbye. bye